How's it going everybody? I'm Levi with JLG Reptiles and today I have some pretty exciting news. Um, it's going to be a rat update and also showing you guys our first babies. So if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing and if you're already subscribed, then welcome back. Alright guys, so here we are with the rats. Um, Again, if you missed our last video on these rats uh, and you're wondering, I'll go ahead and let you know. This is Missouri 6F. And our rats, we, we actually had one of them who had six babies. And then we had one who had ten babies. But with the one who had six, two of hers actually died, which was really unfortunate. Um, and guys, the reason we don't have a lot of bedding in here with these right now is just so the babies don't get like lost in the bedding um that would be kind of horrible to lose one to that but i'm gonna also let you guys know about a little issue i'm running into so here are all the babies um they were born like two days apart and you see how they're just like kind of standing on them these females they're <clears throat> they're actually running and kind of like cutting the babies whenever they run over them i don't really know what needs to be done i think i mean they're just skittish females you know they're not as tame as the male so whenever i open this tub a lot of times i don't even like opening it anymore really um because whenever i open it they all run to the back where the babies are and they kind of just like run over the babies and they're hurting them um one of them actually got cut kind of bad on its back Oops, sorry one just kind of bit me guys didn't mean to move the camera like that but that's them here's a mama but <laughs> But they're doing doing really well. I just don't really know what to do about the deal with them running over them. Um, <clears throat> I think maybe a good plan would be, like, I'm going to take out of these babies, you know, and I was talking about taking three of the females of these babies and putting them into a new tub and starting a new colony. Well, I think I'm actually just going to completely redo my females um i'm gonna get rid of these because they're too skittish you know i don't it, and it's what it is whenever i open the tub you know they just dart to the back and then they start running as hard as they can you know and they're just running on top of the babies their claws are cutting the babies it's just <clears throat> really really hard to actually watch for me uh, you know i i want all these babies to do really well and it's just kind of like the rats are taking out their own babies but like this is Jeff. This is the male, and you know he's he's calm. He's not going to run. But these females, if you scare them, they run so hard, and it's just they're just all over the place. I don't know if you guys have ever experienced this. Um, if you have, definitely let me know. You know what you did to fix it. But I think it's just see because they won't let you pet them. Um, like again, this is Jeff. You know he's. He's chill. He will let you pet him all day long and enjoy it. But the females, see, well, yeah, there she went. And this one, well, she kind of let me pet her a little bit. One of them is a little more tame than the rest, and that might have been her. But, <clears throat> but, yeah, I mean, this is our our first litter. And other than our rats actually doing damage to them, they're actually doing really well. Um, This is from the first litter they were like two days apart you know and you can see these guys are getting a little color to them now pretty cool little hooded rat babies make sure this mama don't jump out but and this is one from the second litter so they're a little smaller but you can see they're starting to get a little bit of color so doing good doing good and they're all healthy they have their little well this one don't really have a little milk belt most of them have the little, yeah, you can kind of see it a little bit there on their side, the little milk, little white spot there on the side of their belly. <clears throat> so they're eating well. Yeah, there's 14 of them in here. There's one hiding. But yeah, the, there's only four of them with the color on them right now because those are only, I said, on the, and they still get kind of buried. I was trying to eliminate that completely, but... They're just so cool. I'm glad we finally got some babies. It's just kind of like, you know, all our hard work paying off to finally see some production. 
But yeah, they, then they just like move them around. Like she just picked that one up and moved it over here for some reason. I don't, I don't really get it. But put it back in the nest. But yes, yeah, so that's that's pretty awesome. I'm I'm super super happy. And maybe like I said, we'll get some. See see, that's what I'm talking about. They just like sprint over top of them, and their claws are super super sharp. You know, it just like does damage. I don't I don't know. I don't know what to do. I think I just need calmer rats, calmer mothers. So we're going to work on that for sure. But, but guys, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I know this is kind of a short video. I just wanted to keep you up to date with our rats. Um, everything's good to go other than the baby's getting cut up by claws. I, I hate it. But guys, if you enjoyed it, please subscribe, give this video a like, and I will see you next time.